पगली चुड़ा लेवे लो तारकी तो है आगे Although the stunning aspects of nature are captured by trail cameras, have you ever wondered what happens when a trail camera captures something that shouldn't be seen? There is a wealth of legend about supposedly mythological animals all across the world. Stories abound about anything from flesh runners in the Appalachian Mountains to Bigfoot having the time of his life in Colorado. For example, one such urban legend is that of the chupacabra, which is claimed to be located someplace in the Americas. Thus, there is a possibility that this video captured a glimpse of chupacabra in Costa Rica. The animal, if you can even call it that, is described as having a similar appearance to that of a dog. So an unsettling four-legged thing can be seen creeping around in the video that was uploaded on X. Also, two dogs can be heard barking at the creature as it moves along. As a result of the fact that it is not quite apparent what it is, many have responded to the video and expressed their hypotheses. Moreover, some individuals believe that it may be something that is malicious. Someone wrote, hmm, very creepy. Probably a shapeshifter. A different person said, My first guess, a troll. My second guess, has to be El Chupacabras. Pen to second. Looks like something that crawled out of hell. A state backed camera trap program in North Carolina took a picture of something that seemed to have eyes that were alien like. So it didn't take long for someone to speculate that the creature in the picture was a monster of some type. An extremely enormous, eerie black eye is seen looking directly into the camera in the unusual photograph that was taken in the dark. Also, the photograph only shows a small portion of the face of whatever it is that is being photographed. What animal can be seen in the photo below? NC Candid Critters posted on X. Some people thought it was a demon, while others said it was a chupacabra, which is a fabled creature that is half dog and half vampire, and is known to drink the blood of other animals and humans. According to the wildlife specialists, the species in question was most likely a deer that had its traits distorted due to the fact that it was so near the camera. However, the camera trap program has a history of sharing unexplainable photographs on its Facebook page. Some of these photos have shown animals fleeing away in fear, while others have seen predators murdering and hauling away their victims via the camera trap. In the month of June, the program gained widespread notice when it published yet another blurry photograph of a creature with scary eyes, which some people thought was an extraterrestrial being caught in the process of examining the camera. Additionally, the purpose of the state-backed camera trap program is to reveal previously unknown information on the distribution of animals throughout the state, particularly the spread of exotic species such as armadillos and coyotes. Each of the 100 counties has cameras installed on both public and private property, and each of these cameras is activated by motion sensors. An unsettling image taken by a trail camera in the state of New York shows what looks to be a ghostly presence following a couple of hunters. In December of 2021, J.C. Grandol took the terrifying photograph that she then shared with Coast to Coast AM. The photograph was taken on their property in the Savona neighborhood when her husband, Bob, and their daughter were out hunting. When he was checking over his trail cam images from the past several years, he saw the scary translucent figure behind them. He made me look at it, and I asked him who was with them, because I don't ever remember them taking anyone hunting with them, Jay-Z recalls. And he said, no one. They were both a bit freaked out by it. Also, JC told the news that her husband later published the picture on social media and that a friend's father seemed to identify the figure as a man called Paul who used to live in our house and he hunted those same woods. He moved out of our place in either late 2003 or early 2004. He died a couple years later. We never met the man, so we don't know what he looked like. In spite of the fact that doubters will undoubtedly argue that the spirit is nothing more than a trick of light and shadow, or the result of digital manipulation, GC is certain that the photograph has not been doctored in any way, and that it was only one of hundreds of otherwise ordinary photographs that were taken by the trail cam. In India, 
Witnesses have reported seeing a scary humanoid-like figure walking across a road. So this has led them to believe that there is some kind of supernatural activity taking place. The strange creature was seen on camera going about its business on a bridge in Jharkhand, which is located in eastern India. Long arms and legs, light white skin, and a very slender torso are all characteristics that seem to be associated with the gangly-looking appearance. The creature pauses and glances at the motorcyclists, and then continues its sluggish stroll. Also, motorcyclists swerve out of the road to escape the figure. The figure was subsequently described by witnesses as being everything from a ghost to a witch, and some of them were even persuaded that it was an extraterrestrial being. After being published to Twitter, and seen almost 50,000 times, the video sparked a heated discussion on whether or not the strange figure was a part of a hoax or whether or not it was indeed a paranormal phenomenon. Another person pointed out something strange happening in the sky 13 seconds into the clip, writing that there's a faint red light in the sky. He continued, in the beginning, you can see it's trying to reach to something. A little child can be seen in the footage casually wandering towards the woods. Yet, there seems to be something ominous following the child. In addition, when the camera moves to follow the ghost, you can see it walk and step behind the child, who seems to be blissfully ignorant that he is not alone. In the last week, the terrifying video was published on YouTube, where it was seen by more than 40,000 people who are interested in the paranormal. Despite the fact that some people were skeptical about the authenticity of the video, there was one person who indicated that the figure that was trailing after the child may have been his guardian angel. Also, the footage was provided by a station that specializes in scary sightings, and the channel claims that this demonstrates without a reasonable doubt that ghosts are real. A video that was recorded over the Canuck Chase woodland has displayed a figure that is terrifying beyond belief, as if it were ripped straight from the narrative of a horror movie. The video, which was taken by a drone, shows what some people are referring to as a black-eyed girl who is reportedly seen racing through the woodland in Staffordshire. But that's not all. It is said that the figure is said to haunt the location. So, one of the things that people keep coming back to is the figure of Black Eyed Girl, which is one of the reasons why Canuck Chase is believed to be one of the most haunted locations in the United Kingdom. Over the years, there have been a number of scary sightings that have occurred at this location. Several individuals have said that they have seen spectral kids with bulging black eye sockets hiding among the woods. It is not quite clear to the people whether these are supposed to be the spirits of people who died from a dreadful sickness that occurred centuries ago or if they were murdered by a hideous murderer in the 1960s. According to one theory, the ghosts of the children with dark eyes are composed of individuals who passed away as a result of an epidemic of diphtheria in the 1800s, and the sickness caused their eyes to seem dark and sunken. Additionally, Raymond Morris, who was responsible for the deaths of three children between the years 1965 and 1967, is the subject of a second theory. The people who were watching the scary video suspected that it may have been a ghost. One of them said that Canuck Chase is well known for things like this, and a second person said that it was seriously creepy footage. Also, some individuals expressed a greater degree of skepticism, inquiring as to whether or not they had driven the drone closer to the girl for a better look. On the other hand, a fear seeker named Tom Buckmaster is said to have spent the night in the woods and had a terrifying experience when he was confronted by strange towns. Another someone who is interested in the supernatural claims that they have seen black-eyed children in Canuck Chase. This individual also asserts that the location is home to werewolves, a pigman, and allegedly even Bigfoot. Hannah and her boyfriend are both early risers and they had the intention of going for a jog in the morning. However, Hannah had the unexpected realization that they were not alone and she was able to capture this moment on video. Grey Lady is a ghost that is said to travel about in a grey cloak and the state park that they visited is famous for having this reputation. According to Hannah, she was carrying her phone with her at the time and when she began to experience strange sensations and saw that her hair was sticking up on her arms, she took her phone from her pocket to see if she could record anything on video. During her 100-mile run in the Hawaiian jungle, runner Cape Orlis was unaware that she was passing by a creepy-looking creature. The mystery creature was captured on camera by Kay's friend Cassie, who was assisting her as a pacer at the time. Also, the night of the moon eclipse was when Kay ran past the enigmatic demon, 
The duo did not become aware of the shadowy and eerie figure until further down the line, when they showed the photographs to their relatives and friends. It was with a frightened expression on her face that Kay shared the photographs to Reddit and said, My pacer took this photo. She continued, Notice the figure in the frame to the left of my head. We never saw anyone passing us, and there were no statues along the trail. It is not photoshopped or made. This is legend, and we saw it the morning of the blood. Later on, Kay disclosed on a podcast that she had experienced further eerie occurrences during that particular evening. The abrupt and severe pain that she felt in her right leg occurred on the fourth lap of her race. She went on to say that the agony was so severe that she abruptly stopped what she was doing and began weeping uncontrollably. During the podcast, she said, I never quit things in life. I have never quit a run before, but this felt different. It was like an out-of-body experience, and I just felt like quitting. It felt like something bad is going to happen to me if I go forward. In other words, for a number of years, Kay has been a devoted runner, but she has made the decision to stop. After giving her verbal consent to the organizers, she and her friend Cassie went back to their errand, and as the two individuals began to browse down the photo album, they were aware of something strange. One of the photographs had Kay rushing past the eerie-looking monster. It was stated by both of them that they had not seen anything throughout their time spent in the Hawaiian rainforests. Yet the photograph presented a different picture. After doing some research on the location, Kay and Cassie came across spooky folklore that was associated with the eerie paths that were located on that mountain. There is a tale that the island is haunted by the spirits of Hawaiian warriors known as Nightmarkers. It is said that anybody who comes into contact with these malevolent beings will suffer a terrible and horrible death. A large number of people came to Reddit in order to share their reactions to the terrifying experience that Kay had. According to the words of one of the users, this is the creepiest thing I have ever seen. Another Redditor wrote, yeah, that genuinely really freaked me out when I watched the live photo. A third said, have you seen the live photo? The thing is see-through and coming out of seemingly nowhere. Even the simplest explanation doesn't seem logical at all actually. A seemingly harmless video of two children playing hide and seek has taken on a far more ominous tone as a result of additional investigation, which revealed that the children in the video may not have been the only ones. An adorable little girl can be seen in the video, which was shot in Mexico, exclaiming, I found you. After seeing a young child hiding behind a giant rock, at the same time as the little child is revealing his identity, what seems to be a towering black figure with blazing eyes appears above him. So TikTok was the platform where the video was uploaded, and users were left wondering if they were seeing an animal, something supernatural, or just an optical illusion or phenomenon. After some time had passed, a slowed down version of the video was uploaded on YouTube in order to better demonstrate the eerie shadow creature. Those that commented offered a great deal of ideas on the content of the video. For example, one person wrote that the figure is actually another girl who has her back turned. The shadow's eyes are the girl's pigtails. On the other hand, another person wrote, I think that all of us who have lived in the countryside or in rural areas know that it is not a good idea to play hide and seek at night. My grandmother said that when it gets dark the demons will be there. Additionally, no formal statement has been made on what the figure is. Shadowy figures have been seen hiding somewhere in the frame, according to one sighting that occurred in Las Vegas this year. Also during the course of this year, Las Vegas has been the site of a number of purported sightings of unidentified flying objects, with one encounter reportedly involving law enforcement authorities. So, the camera zooms in on a forklift truck that seems to have dark figures hiding inside of it. And this specific video shows a group of people seeming anxious as they peek into a backyard that is located behind a home. There was a good deal of uncertainty over the location of the extraterrestrials in the video, but a significant number of individuals are certain that they are present. A person wrote, you can see their face eyes glowing in the first tractor, then look at the second one, you can see it peaking if they eight to 10 feet tall. Another person wrote, Face little left of center of circle, you can see eyes and mouth. In spite of this, the video could provide some new information on the recent spike in the number of sightings and encounters that have occurred in Las Vegas. For example, footage from police body cameras was released, which showed lights that seemed to be hanging in the sky before falling to the ground. 
and this footage was believed to be a sighting of a UFO crash landing. Following reports of the mystery figures, law enforcement officers conducted a comprehensive search, but they did not find any fresh evidence throughout their investigation. On the other hand, a person who claimed to have observed the whole event and even came across an alien being has come forward to say that they were there during the alleged crash landing. My brother told me to look behind the forklift, and I did. I saw the alien creature. So when I saw it, it was a tall, skinny, lengthy creature, the person explained. He was a gray-greenish color, and when I looked it in the eyes, my body just froze. Bear in mind, I'm looking at his whole body. He has weird-looking feet and a big face and eyes. A 21-year-old guy claims that he was able to catch a ghost on video. So, a supposed ghost of a soldier was seen sitting calmly on a seat as captured on video that has gone viral because of its disturbing appearance. Northam was the location where Josh Newton and George Moore captured the video when they were driving through the town. In other words, the video depicts the hazy form of a guy who will not allow you to turn in for the night. It was discovered that the otherworldly body was contained inside a military monument that was dedicated to honoring the lives of troops who had died during the First and Second World Wars. For more videos like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button and like this video. Comment below which case you find the most terrifying, and don't forget to press the bell icon for future notifications.